Welcome back, awesome Action Toy fans and subscribers. It is Toy Hall time again. Another Toy Hall. My second, I think, for April. Is it my third? I think it's my second one for April. Again, this is a Marvel heavy one. Now, if you want to check what's in this without watching the whole video, just go to the video description below and it'll be in the timestamp. So let's start. And I'm really excited with this first one. I got three of these number 57 Deep Sea Ripper 124 scale kits if you've not bought a a uh, number 57 kit before you need to get them they are amongst the top kits out there very very good highly detailed um good articulation very good quality plastic and the engineering is off the chart so through those boxes if we look at the uh, side we can see one of these uh, shark mecha things with the scenario piece that comes with it. If we look on the other side, it shows you get this head, this head, this head, and also you can make it into a high thrust mode. Looks really good. In fact, I'll have a quick look inside. I'll look at those heads and see what uh, sort of size they are. Can I see them anywhere? Normally they're loose, the heads, or maybe I'm wrong this time. Let's have a look. Oh, hello. I did see a head just then. Where did it disappear to? Okay, so this is the... Wow! This is the unpainted version. I'm assuming they come with painted versions too. They normally do. Oh, yeah. Even better. So... Oh, wow. They are huge. That will work a 118. I want to make a King Shark figure. These will work a 118 scale. And I will... In fact, I'll keep it out of the box and have a look at that with a 118 scale figure later so we can see. So, I will be making one or all of these, if not tomorrow. Probably, actually, probably I'll make it on Saturday night. I want to make it on Sunday, but I'm working Sunday. No! Um, so, I'll be making one of those soon, and that'll be another video to look forward to. So, the heads I'll just leave off camera for now. Uh, next and last boxed thing, I think. I got a Halo... Um, Jazzwares Halo Wave 5 figure. This is Sergeant Johnson with Assault Rifle. Now, I've not seen him before or any of the Wave 5. I don't know how new they are. So you've got Master Chief, you've got ODST, you've got Sergeant Johnson, you've got Spartan Lock, you've got Arbitar, is it Thale or Thale Vidam? No idea how to pronounce that. And Grunt Grenadier. Sergeant Johnson does look pretty cool. I've got to say, it will go well with my uh, Marines that I got from this line too. Let's stick him over here. Yeah, I'll put the other box back at the top. The rest of the stuff will probably fit in. Um, next from Lambda, I got yet another of their aliens, green aliens. So I've got four of these green aliens here and one of the silver one. From Fortnite, I've got my first lot of their mini Figures, the articulated mini ones. So I've got the Skull Trooper, who is absolutely really quite cool. Um, probably my favourite is Dark Voyager. I've got this one here because he'll work with my gnomes and my elves in fantasy. Well, not really my elves, but my gnomes. And then I got a Peely, but the Peely, his uh, right arm is the left arm, so he's got a wrong arm on in there. Anything else non Marvel related? I think the rest is all Marvel, and there's a lot of it too. Okay, so I picked up a r rogue, another rogue figure, who I've got a few of, um, two or three. I picked up another scroll, Marvel Universe scroll this time. In the last toy haul, I got six of the uh, Captain America scroll ones. I got really happy about this. Two more of the Red Hand Ninjas. So my ninjas are getting more and more and more. I got ooh, an AIM scientist. Can just about fit there. I got, is it A bomb? I think. I got two more hulks. And to go the uh, 12 Hydra heads I got the other day, I got eight Hydra. Oh, soldiers. So these eight plus the two that I got recently, the box ones, which are basically the same. Um, that makes 10. And plus with the 12 heads, I can do 22 
Hydra soldiers or have it as a different sort of whatever in my universe. So loads and loads of goodies yeah, in this toy haul. So I am happy with that. That's a great load of stuff there. Good variety, good for your customization, custom customs and whatnot. And obviously I'm army but not because I'm doing a Hydra army because I'm gonna use these in my own universe as something else eventually, probably. Never mind. Okay, so let's have a look at this uh King Shark heads. Or, or rather the um the deep sea ripper heads. I'm saying that could work as a king shark. Let me just open this plastic bag first and take the heads out. Then what I use is probably one of the uh Hulk figures since they are oops since they are big and King Shark is big and this will obviously be a 118 scale. And let's have a look. I reckon these are gonna be pretty damn good. Okay, so all three heads are out. Let's get one of the hulks. Let's get him out of this plastic, horrible, cheap bag prison they put him in. Okay, so here's the Hulk who is a big one acting scale figure. I have reviewed this guy previously. I'll stick him in suggested videos for you in the top right. They it is a great figure, it has to be said. Looks pretty cool. Let's have a look at the heads. Look at that. I'll just rest it on top. There you go. There is a uh, <laughs> bit of work. You've got a semi -king, sh king shark figure there. The other one. Again. And then it also comes with a hammerhead. What's nice is that it also comes with uh, three heads the same but unpainted. Very, very cool. Fantastic toy haul. I'm very happy with that. Do subscribe if you've not done so already. Click on the notification icon to, to so you don't miss any reviews, news, and other videos that I release in the soon and coming future. Stay happy and keep collecting. Bye-bye.